Hey Carlos, how's it going? This is the tutorial for the song Agua del Amor by Ayla Schaefer. A very nice song. I'm going to demonstrate the main riff and then I'll open the tabs file and I'll walk you through it. Um, and also I wanted to show something with the lyrics and chord sheet. Let's start with the main riff. We have a really cool finger picking riff here. It goes like this. So this is the main riff in the first half of the song and what is really nice about this riff, the chords are pretty simple but we have a lot of movement with the bass here which is very nice, it gives a nice kind of like a walking bass feeling. I'm going to open now the tabs file so let's have a look how it looks like. In terms of the chords, we have pretty straightforward chords here, all of the chords are here on the tabs file, we have the capo on the first fret, the chords are D minor, F, A minor again D minor F A minor then E minor A minor E minor A minor so all standard chords and um, <clears throat> let's see what happens here with the finger picking pattern so with the D minor and the F the bass is on the fourth string so we play four and then the two, top two strings together and the third okay then we change quickly to the F chord and we play four three two one three Alright, then we go to the A minor chord and here we start to have this nice bass stuff going on. So we play bass on the 5th string. And then on the last beat we have the bass on the 4th string. So we play bass, 2 one, 3 2 one, 3 and then 4-3. Um, then the same thing repeats itself. And then we have a similar thing here on the transition from the E minor to the A minor. We have bass on the 6th string then 5th and then 4th. So we have E minor, okay, 6, 5, 4, then A minor 5. Okay, so basically all of these notes, the bass notes, you want to try to highlight them. So to play them a little bit stronger, you play all of them with the thumb. We want to make them stand out in the mix, so you really hear the bass line as you transition through the chords, it really gives the piece a nice musical edge. Um, so this is the first part of the song until timestamp 104 and then the chord sequence change. Um, so I wrote here the timestamps for this sequence here, A, M, E, M, G, C, G slash B and A, M. And the part that's in the middle between three, uh, between 224 and 3, 29 is again the same sequence as here. Okay, and here between 356 and 430, that's just um, no guitar like a cappella. Um, so let's have a look at this part now. Sounds like this A minor, E minor, G, C, B, A minor. Here the finger picking pattern is more straightforward, it just repeats itself. So we have bass, 2 one, 3 4 3 2 one, 3 same on the E minor and same on the G. And what happens on the fourth bar, I wrote C, G slash B, then A minor. But in actuality you only need one finger. So you can see we, we need this finger here and then that finger here, the second fret of the fifth string. So it's a very fast walking bass line, A minor. Okay, um, and then the last thing that I wanted to mention, you see that I wrote here on the E minor, sometimes replaced with C chords, C lyrics chord sheet. So in like most of the times it's an E minor chord, but there are a few specific lines where they play a C chord there instead of E minor. So you can see that in the lyrics chord sheet, you can see exactly where it is in the in the structure of the song and on top of which words. So this is basically the, the song in terms of practicing. I highly recommend sticking to the traditional 
finger picking technique, which means you use the bass, the thumb on the bass string, so the sixth, fifth, and fourth strings, and then you use the index finger for the third string, middle finger for the second string, and ring finger for the first string. And in this case, as I explained with the tabs, you want to highlight the bass line. You want to make it kind of stronger than the top string so it stands out in the mix. I hope this makes sense. Try it out, try the tabs, try the lyrics, chord sheet. Let me know if you have any questions and I'll see you soon. Have a nice day.